sounded bad. There's like a bomb going off. Maybe some attack. Must have been Penguin. Makes sense. Or could have been any one of them. Penguin's got the muscle, I guess, but so is the Black Mask. Hell, cutting the city in two? What's the bat doing here? Batman! It's Batman! I know you work for Riddler. How? I mean, yes! Please, don't hurt me. I'll tell you everything. There was never any doubt in my mind. This is Penguin's turf, you freak. I'm gonna cut you up into tiny pieces for breaking in here. I don't think I want you breaking into my little home, Batman. Nearby, world famous ice 
Something's blocking communication back to the Batcave. Penguin must be using military-grade communication disruptors. The only way to crack this security is to destroy them. Welcome to the Cyrus Pinkney Natural History Institute. All visitors must be as part of our ongoing commitment to keep you safe and protect you have on display. I'll never get past the security. I should head back outside and search for Penguin's jammer. Does this thing work anyway? All you need to know is Penguin wants this thing powered up. While it's working, no one in this hellhole can use anything that broadcasts out into Gotham. So that's why my cell phone stopped working. Yes, dumbass, that's why your cell stopped working. Did you even listen at the briefing? Nah. Figures. Listen, this is the deal. If anyone interferes with this tower, it will be our fault. Mr. Cobblepot doesn't like it when his people fail him. The jamming tower has three terminals attached. I need to destroy all three to shut it down. One jammer down. I should look for more. What's going on out there? One of the jammer signals disappeared. Sorry, Mr. Cobblepot. I, I, I don't know. We'll find out! And while you're doing it, make sure the other jammer's safe, or I'll find you and I'll stick with them. According to the log, all wave frequencies are being suppressed. The entire site is radio secure. Nice. Where does Cobblepot get military-grade kit like this from? He's a collector. He's got things you've never heard of in that museum. Crazy stuff. Like what? No way, man. First thing you learned about Cobblepot, keep your mouth shut. Don't leave me hanging. Tell me. Funny. That's what happened to the last guy. What do you mean? He was left hanging, minus his legs, of course, over a pit of rats. He did good, lasted days. Cobblepot was pissed, so we fed him to his pet. You're kidding me. Do I look like I'm joking? Penguin's an animal. Just do what he says and keep your nose out of his business and you'll keep breathing. What the hell? be happening!
pajamas up top. Where are the rest of you idiots? We've only just managed to get below ground. Just send it up wherever you are. Do it now. Batman's probably on his way down there. Understand? Yes, sir, Mr. Cobblepot. The signal's blocked again. It sounds like Penguin's final jammer was activated somewhere underneath Arkham City. Set up another comms disruptor. I guess he's still trying to screw with Batman. Penguin sounded pissed. Batman's been screwing with his plans. Those things even work underground? I read the manual. It never said anything about working on the ground. Yeah, they work. If you say... I'm telling you, it's him. It can't be. It is. Look again. He looks big, right? He's gray. This poster's got to be over a hundred years old. How can it be the same guy? And even if it was, how did Penguin get it? I don't know, but I'm sure it is. It's even got a name. Solomon Grundy? Ah, stupidest name I ever heard. That's the thing you can hear in the museum. You know, Solomon Grundy, born on a Monday. You may be right. What's the bat doing here? wanted a chance to go up against that freak. But I thought he wanted us to drag this thing over to the Joker. He did. I guess Batman's made him change his plan. Who cares? Kill Batman, drag this thing to Joker, turn it over, and go back to Cobblepot as heroes. What? Just like that? Kill Batman? Yeah. I'm not scared. He's nothing. Just some idiot in a costume. He's nothing. Disruptor stop working. Batman will be free to stroll right into my lovely museum. And if you let that happen, I'll make sure you all get to see what I'm keeping under the iceberg. Anyone wants lounge. a piece of me? Step up and give it your best shot. Come on, 
Wake up! Damn it, he's out cold! He's making us look stupid. How's he doing it? Leave him. We've got more important things to be looking out for. Show yourself, chicken! I've lost one of you idiots. Let's end it there. Penguin gave an order, so move! There's someone here! This is no good. He won't wake up. How's he? What the hell? I'm running out of patience. You're running out of people. Let's see what runs out first. Don't make me hurt you. I'll tell you what I know. Thank you. That was the last jammer. I should be able to get into the museum now. Speak. Oh, Batman, you sound impatient. That is good. That is very good. You'll need that to solve my little game. You may have heard that I have been providing salvation to the mindless drones lucky enough to answer my calls. Hardly salvation. You've been killing them. That's a question of perspective. For example, from where I'm standing... I can see three little piggies just waiting for me to cure them of life. From their perspective, I'd imagine they see things differently. If you hurt them, Zez, I will hunt you down. I bet you will. But first, a little game. Right now, somewhere in Arkham City, there's a phone ringing. 
I know it's a big place, but you need to find it. Take too long, and I kill these piggies. And don't try anything clever. I had a friend help me bounce the signal through every relay from here to Bloodhaven. You'll never find me. Now hang up that phone and start running. Ring, 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 ring. you about my first kill, Batman? No? As I am sure you are aware, my parents were dead and I was rich. So rich I could have anything I wanted, but of course, all I wanted was them back. I now know that that was impossible, of course, that their death served a higher purpose. But back then, I had yet to experience the joy of cold steel cutting through warm flesh. I had no idea how I could save these people from the relentless misery of their existence. You should have stayed that way. Really? Then I'll stop now. Find another telephone, Batman. Goodbye. <laughs> 